milk. You put it in your cereal. You dip your cookies in it. You drink it for the calcium. Some people like coal, others 2%, and some like skim. Randy Sowers makes his own skim milk at his creamery in Maryland. I'm Randy Sowers, and we started South Mountain Creamery in 2000. I love being a dairy farmer, and I love selling all natural products. Randy's an awesome guy, but now he's a little upset. If I want to sell my customers an all natural skim milk, the government will make me label it in a ridiculous way. Before we explain why, we'll show you how skim milk is made. Just in case you missed it, let's try that again. This is how you make all natural skim milk. First, you need a cow. After milking it, you have to pasteurize the milk, skim the milk, add artificial vitamins, and finally bottle it. Wait, something isn't natural here. For some reason, the government forces farmers to add synthetic vitamins, even if the customers don't want it. In order to sell all natural skim milk, the government says I'd have to label it as imitation skim milk. If Randy sells pure skim milk with an honest label, the FDA will fine him $1,000 per violation and could close down his entire creamery. Now, Randy has teamed up with the Institute for Justice to file a First Amendment lawsuit against the FDA. Randy is not suing for money. All he wants is to be allowed to tell the truth. 